Hi everyone! Today I'm gonna make a quick card um, just using a stamp and a border punch and then of course some paper. Uh, as I've shown you in a previous video I always when I make cards go through my uh, scrap box and just pull out some papers and come up with cards. So that's what I did today too. I s I'm gonna start off with a base card. This is a light brown color that I just folded in half which is going to be the base of my card and it's going to be a card that opens this way. The first thing that I'm going to do is take a white piece of paper and I'm going to stamp on it. I'm going to use a stamp that uh, I've used in a previous video too with these flowers but this is going to be a totally different card. Okay. I'm going to use this archival ink from Ranger because I think it makes a beautiful image, uh, crisp and nice saturated colors. So that's why I love to use that. And very juicy ink pad too. I'm just gonna pull it a little bit to me to so that I can center it. Press firmly. Okay. This is my image. Okay. As you can see I uh, the, the flowers is a little bit at the top and that's because I'm gonna take this little piece here and go put down here as a little um, grass. This is actually a paper. Let's see if I can find this. So as you can see this is from uh, the packaging from some Prima embellishment of some kind that uh, I've just used my scallop border punch from Fiskars and cut this out to fit. So I'm just gonna adhere this um, and I also I actually put it through the crimper or my little cousin did um, when they come to visit they always uh, spend a lot of time in my craft room and make a lot of things and uh, he made this and put it through the crimper and didn't use it anyway so I could benefit from it another thing that I did is stamp these uh, stamp the stamp on this piece of paper with a lot of dots to get a lot of color and I already did that and cut those out to put in the centers to jazz it up just a little bit more so, so I'm just gonna adhere those There we go, a little bit color to the flowers. Then what I'm going to do is mat this with this piece of uh, paper, which is, I believe, from an October afternoon paper. I'm gonna, just going to put that on the top. Like that. Now it's nicely matted. I'm gonna bring in this base of the card and then also a strip of blue paper that's gonna go here in the back and I'm just gonna put that on and it opens this way so I'm gonna put it a little bit to the left hand side and leaving a little bit of room over here. Like so, and there's a little bit of overhang, so I'm just going to trim that with my scissors. Okay, then I'm going to adhere this, this piece on top, like this, can you see? Okay, that's it so far. Then I'm just going to take a white gel pen and I'm just going to make some faux stitching all the way around the piece here. Okay. 
Okay, so I'm all done with that. Can you see that? It's full stitched all the way around. And that's the card. Uh, it's very, very simple and very, very quick. So I hope you liked it. And uh, thanks for watching. Bye.